Introducing the OneTouch Varial Flex Meter with ColorShore technology. Testing with Control Solution. This video doesn't replace your owner's booklet. Before using OneTouch Vario Control Solution to test your meter and test strips are working together properly, carefully read the instructions for use in the owner's booklet that comes with your meter and package inserts that come with the components of the system. For example, perform a control solution test if you have had repeated unexpected blood glucose readings or if the meter was accidentally dropped or damaged. You should also perform a control solution test whenever you open a new vial of test strips. First, let's prepare the meter. Take one of your OneTouch Vario test strips and insert it into the meter test strip port, making sure that the gold side of the test strip and two silver prongs are facing you. Wait for the flashing blood drop icon to appear on the display. Press and hold the up or down button until the control solution icon C appears on the display. Invalid results may be logged into your history if you apply control solution to the test strip without following the instructions. The meter is now ready. Let's put it to one side while we prepare the control solution. OneTouch Vario control solution and test strips are available separately. For availability of test strips and control solution, contact customer service or ask your pharmacist or healthcare professional. There are two control solution options available, OneTouch Vario Level 3 control solution and OneTouch Vario Level 4 control solution. When a new vial of control solution is opened, record the discard date on the vial label. This is the date opened plus six months. Do not use after the expiry or discard date, whichever comes first. Make sure that your meter, test strips, and control solution are at the same temperature before testing. Before removing the cap, shake the vial gently. Remove the vial cap and place it on a flat surface with the top of the cap pointing up. We need to make sure that we squeeze the vial to discard the first drop. Do not swallow or ingest control solution. Wipe both the tip of the control solution vial and the top of the cap with a clean, damp tissue or cloth. Squeeze a drop into the small well on the top of the cap or onto another clean, non-absorbent surface. We're now ready for testing to take place. Hold the meter so that the side edge of the test strip is at a slight angle to the drop of control solution. Touch the channel on the side of the test strip to the control solution. Wait for the channel to fill completely. The meter will count down until the test is complete. Here's an example of what your result could look like. It will show you the glucose level found in the solution. Your result is displayed along with the date, time, unit of measure, and C for control solution and stored in the meter. Control solution results can be seen when reviewing past results on the meter. Each vial of OneTouch Vario test strips has both OneTouch Vario Level 3 control solution and OneTouch Vario Level 4 control solution ranges printed on the label. Compare the result displayed on the meter to the OneTouch Vario control solution range printed on the test strip vial, depending on the type of control solution you used. The control solution range printed on the test strip vial are for control solution tests only and are not recommended ranges for your blood glucose level. If you continue to get control solution results that fall outside the range printed on the test strip vial, do not use the meter, test strips, or control solution. Contact customer service. When testing is complete, clean the top of the control solution cap with a clean, damp tissue or cloth. Remember to keep all of your kit together so you have everything you need exactly when you need it. Want to know more? Call 1-888-567-3003 for English or 1-888-567-3010 for Spanish customer services or visit www.onetouch.com. OneTouch. Every touch is a step forward.